Imagine a world nearly a billion years ago, long before the first dinosaurs roamed. The first inhabitants weren't creatures you'd expect. Welcome to Earth's first fungi. These incredible organisms started a revolution unseen right beneath our feet. What secrets do they hide? How did they shape the world we know today? Join us as we journey into the cryptic past, shedding light on these underappreciated architects of life. Beneath the naked gaze of our eyes, hidden within an ancient fragment of rock, there lies a secret that could rewrite the history of life on Earth. Steve Bonneville, a seasoned researcher at the Université Libre de Bruxelles, once doubted its very existence, claiming, that's impossible, it's too old, when he was first confronted with the suggestion that this fossil was, in fact, the remnants of a primeval fungus. For years, we believed that fungi, an unassuming cast of characters including mushrooms, mold, and yeast, first graced the Earth around half a billion years ago. But now, the story of their origin is being rewritten, with the time scale dramatically pushed back by findings unearthed from the Canadian wilderness, the fossil of an ancient fungi. Published recently in the prestigious journal Nature, an international research team reported on this monumental find fungi fossils dating back between 900 million and 1 billion years. The discovery of chitin, a unique substance adorning the cell walls of fungi, confirmed their identity. Subsequent age dating determined by careful analysis of radioactive isotopes within the specimen cast light upon the era they originated from. This recent discovery has sent ripples through the scientific community, nudging our perception of life's origins on Earth and rewriting the chronology of evolution. Before this revelation, the title of the oldest known fungi went to a specimen from the Middle Paleozoic era, approximately 460 million years old. Fungi, much like mushrooms, molds, and yeasts we see today, belong to eukaryotic organisms. These are entities whose cell walls contain a nucleus wrapped in a cell membrane, a feature they share with other eukaryotes, notably plants and animals. If fungi marked their presence on Earth a billion years ago, it's plausible to believe their plant and animal cousins were around too, leading us to rethink our understanding of life's chronology. A team led by Corentin Lauren, a PhD candidate from the University of Liege, Belgium, meticulously examined these microfossils to reveal their true nature. By identifying the presence of chitin, a fibrous substance forming fungal wall cells, and dating the rock encompassing the fossils via its radioactive elements, they estimated these fossils to be between 900 million to a staggering 1 billion years old. Did you know that fungi, plants, and animals all fall under the same umbrella of life known as eukaryotes? And as Lauren elaborates, if fungi were already present around 1 billion years ago, so should animals have been. He further added that this distant past, although very different from today, may have been much more modern than we thought. Fungi's influence is vast. In terms of global biomass, fungi rank third, surpassed only by plants and bacteria. Weighing six times heavier than the collective mass of all animals, including humans, their presence on Earth is immense. But it's not just about quantity. During their billion-year evolutionary journey, fungi have become biochemical geniuses. As Jerry Wright, a biochemistry professor at McMaster University puts it, fungi are absolutely remarkable chemists. They can concoct molecules that continue to elude human laboratory replication, and we've only begun to scratch the surface of the knowledge they hold. There's a lot to appreciate about fungi, from their extraordinary survival skills to their integral role in the development of life on Earth. Without their silent toil, neither terrestrial plants nor animals as we know them would exist. Picture the stage of life around half a billion years ago. The first players, the fungi, enter, slowly carving minerals from rocks and manufacturing what we now call soil. Not long after, they developed a partnership with liverworts, the debut plants on our green planet. Katie Field, an associate professor in plant-soil interactions at the University of Leeds, explains, Ultimately, fungi helped plants move away from being these marginal, tiny little things on the water's edge into large forests and entire ecosystems. The fungi, in essence, played a crucial role in painting the planet green and altering the very composition of the Earth's atmosphere. Fast forward to the Devonian era, 360 million years ago, 
in a world yet untouched by trees, where only invertebrates had braved the transition to land, fungi reigned supreme. Meet Prototaxites, gigantic fungi that towered over the landscape at a majestic 8 meters in height. This towering mystery baffled scientists for over a century, with debates rife over whether they were fungi, trees, lichens, or plants. Alas, these towering fungi met their end at the hands of early insects, becoming a plentiful food source for the evolving fauna. Interestingly, fungi played a critical role in our very existence. Around 65 million years ago, an asteroid strike triggered a cataclysmic event that wiped out 70% of all life on Earth. In the aftermath, the planet was a fungal paradise. The decaying plant life proliferated fungi across the globe. Meanwhile, mammals, blessed with their warm-blooded nature, held an evolutionary trump card over their reptilian counterparts. Arturo Casadevall, a professor of public health at John Hopkins University, explains, the reptiles are quite susceptible to fungal diseases, but your typical mammal creates a thermal exclusionary zone for fungi. Thus, the survivors of this event became the ancestors of all mammals alive today, from majestic elephants to us lowly humans. Without fungi, our forests would choke under the weight of their own dead. They are the garbage disposal agents of the natural world, says Lynn Boddy, a biosciences professor at Cardiff University. Fungi masterfully break down organic matter, returning essential nutrients to the soil for new life to flourish. It's how everything is reborn, adds Rob Dunn, a professor at North Carolina State University. Fungi, in essence, consume death to cultivate life. Fungi aren't solitary operators. They form a network known as mycelium, connecting plants and trees in an intricate subterranean highway, the Wood Wide Web. These networks facilitate nutrient transportation and danger signal transmission across the forest. Thus, fungi subtly direct the symphony of life in our forests. From facilitating the birth of forests to shaping the course of evolution, fungi have masterfully pulled the strings of life from beneath the Earth's surface. So the next time you tread softly through a forest, remember, beneath your feet lies a world unseen where fungi rule supreme. Now pause for a second and think about Otzi, the 45,000-year-old man frozen in the Tyrolean Alps clutching ornate strings of fungi. Scientists speculate these mushrooms held spiritual significance, but a medicinal purpose seems likely too. As Ursula Paintner from the University of Innsbruck noted, fungi enhance your immunity system and will help fight against cancer and inflammation. They are also antiviral and antibacterial, so they have a large variety of medicinal properties. Journey back thousands of years to the dawn of civilization and you'll find humans gathered around not partying, but drinking beer. This wasn't a party trick, but a survival tactic. Yeast, a single-celled fungus, sanitized potentially contaminated water by annihilating harmful bacteria. The past century itself witnessed the discovery of penicillin by Alexander Fleming. This unassuming fungus, an accidental discovery, held the power to combat bacterial epidemics, altering the course of human history and spurring a tripling of the human population. As our numbers continue to rise, we turn once again to our fungal allies for assistance. Scientists estimate a staggering 5 million species of fungi occupy our planet, yet we've only unveiled a minuscule 1% of this realm. It's a tantalizing mystery waiting to be unraveled, and as Dunn notes, recently our curiosity has been sparked with an intriguing question. How do we seek out and discover not just any average fungus, but those that could hold incredible benefits for humanity? Whether it be repurposing industrial waste, revolutionizing food sources, or unearthing new medicines, fungi have proven time and again to be the silent heroes of our history. Dunn captures this perfectly. Most of the amazing secrets of nature are still out there, waiting to be found. You are both on a careful hunt and also having fun fumbling around a bit. That's a wrap for today, folks. But beware, the most thrilling discoveries are yet to come. So keep your eyes peeled and see you next time.